Man, I am getting a new rug, actually, even though my dad already um, took out um, the old rug in the hallway, actually, that, um, the old rug um, in the hallway, even though I am getting a new rug as well, actually, which, yeah, which, um, my, this stuff over here is now empty, it's now in boxes now, so, yeah, I mean, where's my, um, musician's hat, actually, I mean, where is it? Oh, wait a minute, I don't need it, um, for this review, actually, but, yeah, which, um, speaking of musicians, so yeah, guys, so today I am going to be doing my, um, my short review on Presto. So yeah, guys, so before I go right over here, I am going to say this, poof, magic. So yeah, so I am going to go right over here, right now, actually, so yeah, which I'm going to do it right now. Oh, actually, so yeah, which I am going to have fun reviewing, um, this short, so yeah. Cue the intro. Okay guys, this is it. And today I'm gonna to be doing my short review on this short right now today. So yeah, it is a Pixar short, so I am going to be reviewing this short today, which I always wanted to um um do a short review on this short. I've always wanted to re to review this short actually. So yeah. So, without further ado, I am going to be doing my short review on this short right now today. So yeah. So, let's get started. So yeah. Hey guys, this is Evans Disney's Animation Film Fanatic 2024 here and today. Guess what guys? And today I'm going to be doing my short review on Presto came in the year of 2008. So yeah. So yeah guys, so I am going to read this plot on the internet. So yeah. So basically about the plot's about a stage musician's rabbit gets into a mag gets into a magical on stage um brow um against his um negativism I mean, I actually meant to say, n n I meant to say his negligent um guardian with two um magic hats. It's a um a stage musician, in a, 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 a stage musician in um in, um in his rabbit gets into um a magical on stage, which, which yeah, which um I've already read this plot already, so yeah. Which, yeah. So, yeah, guys. So, that's basically what the plot's about, about this short. So, yeah. So, I did remember that this short actually did come out at the, um, Annecy International Animation Film Festival on, um, on June 10th of 2008. And it got released in front of Wally -E on June, on June 27th of 2008 as well. And I know this short is actually, um, and I know already this short is actually, um, five minutes and it, and um 17 seconds actually which is not that long actually which also yeah and also um also yeah and also presto was actually written was actually written and directed by pixar veteran doug sweetland um i meant to say pixar animator doug sweetland in his directorial debut with his with the story written by um by ted um um, Matt Holt and, um, Lillian, um, Appleine, which, so I mispronounced that person's name, but it's okay. And also Justin Wright as well. Oh, which, fun fact, the original idea for the short was a, mu a musician, I mean, I meant to say a, a musician, and, um, introduced a rabbit into his, um, act, act who suffered from um stage fright it, it this was considered to be too long and complicated which <coughs> so i guess he just coughed so yeah which now let's go back on to the review so yeah um was um the uh let's um, go back into this so yeah and this idea was considered to be too long and complicated and the idea was reworked into a designer the state to design the stage featured in presto the filmmakers visited um the filmmakers visited several opera houses and theaters 
for the design for set design ideas problems worse on um, when trying to animate the theater audience of um um two two hundred and five hundred patterns uh this was a demand to be too expensive and was revolved was resolved by showing the back of the audience which yeah yeah and also fun fact i mean this short was actually um you know this short is a gag um filled homage to um to classic cartoons such as tom and jerry um and the looney tunes as as well all which yeah but yeah i know this this short is, was actually an homage to um tom and jerry and um looney tunes which honestly yeah I know that um Doug, which yeah, which I will get into a, a bit. So yeah, so yeah, guys. So, so yeah, guys. So what do I think of this short? I have to say, this is definitely one of Pixar's best shorts. I mean, Presto is definitely one of Pixar's best shorts. Which yeah, I know this short came out like fifteen and a half years ago, or should I say sixteen years ago actually? Which I know this short is going to be turning um sixteen in this year which yeah and also um yeah even though this short is actually this short is actually directed by Jug doug sleetland who also was um an animator on a bug's life and toy story 2 and he also do directed this short presto and he also was um on the supervising animator on um on cars as well and also and he also directed Storks as well, which, which um, fun fact on um September twenty fourth of um two thousand ten, it was reported that Sweetland had ha had been hired by Sony Animation to direct um, a computer anime movie of the Familians um novel series, but it was canceled. Old, but the project has been canceled. But but he did move to Warner Animation Group to work on Storks, which yeah, which I know he um direct. I know that Doug Sleetland also directed Storks. As, I mean, I mean, Doug um, Sleetland actually directed Storks as well. Which um, his um, his Presto, his sh short movie um Presto, actually mm, animation de is definitely um very similar to Storks like, with the character animation. Like it, it's very similar to Looney Tunes and um. Um, Tom and Jerry and Looney Tunes, yeah, that that con that con that cartoony style animation in um Storks was integrated in um in Storks as well. Even though um Doug Sweetland actually directed um actually did direct um Storks with Nicholas Storer, so yeah, and yeah. I mean, this is definitely a fantastic short. I mean, yeah. I mean, Presto is definitely a fantastic short. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. Even though um he pitched. The film at um in the start of two thousand seven and it began production late last late later in the year of two thousand seven and it was completed in um in May of two thousand eight as well which yeah and also yeah and yeah this short is definitely really hilarious and really funny at the exact same time I mean yeah and yeah. I mean, this is a fantastic short. So yeah, so so now let's talk about the, yeah, yeah. And this short was also um has great gags in this short as well, and also yeah. And now let's talk about the um the music in the short. I meant to say the music and the score of this short, which is actually composed by um Scott um Scott Stafford, which um Str Scott Stafford, which um. I thought um his score of um this short was definitely fantastic. It still holds up to this day, sixteen years later, or should I say, fifteen and a half years later. It still is absolutely phenomenal. So yeah, and now let's talk about the. I mean, enough said. So yeah, now let's talk about the animation of the short, which honestly it still holds up to this day, fifteen and a half years later, or should I say, sixteen years later. It still looks absolutely phenomenal and really fantastic at the exact same time. I mean, yeah, I mean even the stage in this movie definitely does look fantastic. So overall, enough said. So yeah. So overall, guys, I mean, I forgot to mention that this short was also nominated for um for um an Annie Award and an Academy Award for um, Best Animated Short as well. So yeah, 
so yeah guys so overall i have nothing else to say about the about presto so yeah so yeah guys so if you haven't seen presto we've been highly recommended so yeah it is streaming on disney plus so yeah guys so so this review was a bit short so yeah so i will give um this um short on um, presto uh 10 out of 10 spectacular so yeah guys what do you think of my short review on presto so yeah Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel, and make sure to like this video. So yeah, so stay tuned for my re-review. I meant to say my re-review on Matilda, which will be coming out this Friday on um on March twenty second this year. I was gonna be doing my uh, movie review on company on Comfort Panda four on Friday, March twenty second, but I decided I didn't feel like reviewing that movie. But yeah, I decided not to. But that's okay. So yeah. I am. I was supposed to review. Re, I I was supposed to re-review Matilda tomorrow on March on Wednesday, March um twentieth of this year. But now I'm, I am re-reviewing that on Friday um March twenty second of this year. So see you with that. So yeah, so yeah, guys. So I am gonna sing for you guys before I end this video. So yeah, so yeah. Who's your favorite fearless hero? Who's your favorite fearless hero? I am ready, come on, I'm ready. I'm impatient in setbacks and steady. Bless me now as you blessed us all those years ago when you gave us a miracle. Am I too late for a miracle? I'm just Ken, anywhere else I be attend. Isn't my destiny to live and buy a life on property? I'm just Ken, anywhere else I see a friend. What did it take for her to see the man be highlighted and fight for me? Remember me, though I have to say goodbye, remember me. See the light where the sky meets the sea, it calls me, and no one knows before it goes. If the wind in my sail on the sea stays behind me, one day I'll know how far I'll go. Oh. Okay guys, so I'll see you guys later and see you guys in my next review. So yeah, so I'll see you guys later and bye.